Good morning, greetings, and welcome to The Bright Side, your nutritional program dedicated to the understanding of the vast world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. I'm your host, Pharmacist Ben. Nutritional pharmacist from Boulder, Colorado. I specialize in using nutritional supplements where other healthcare practitioners use toxic pharmaceutical drugs and sometimes deadly medical procedures. If you suspect that there are natural nutritional roads to your vitality and health and well-being and to addressing your health challenges, whatever they may be, but you don't know where to begin, you have come to the right place. As you listen to The Bright Side every day, you are more and more in control of your body. You are more and more knowledgeable, and you know you can overcome any health issue. That's why we're here every day on The Bright Side helping clear up the sometimes confusing world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. Over the last 29 years of practicing pharmacy, I've seen drug-free recoveries from diabetes and hypertension and obesity and skin diseases like psoriasis, eczema, rosacea, acne, digestive ailments, autoimmune issues of all kinds. Recoveries that by the standards of modern medicine can only be called a miracle. But what is in the world of the body, what is in the world of biology, standard operating procedure. Because the human body is a healing system, it's a regenerating system, it is designed divinely to heal and renew itself on a moment-to-moment -moment basis, and while some folks may call that a miracle, it really is just the way the body works. If you have questions about health or nutrition or prescription drugs, if you want to wean yourself off your meds and get on a good nutritional supplement program, we are here for you. We welcome your calls on the bright side, 844-236-6010 is our number, 844-236-6010. If you I uh, have tried to get on board in the past and ha uh, been confronted with full lines. Now's your opportunity. Try to call in early, and we'll get to as many calls as possible at 844-236-6010. If you want to purchase any of the Longevity products you hear advertised in the program, you can head over to brightsideben.com, order products right off the website, likewise criticalhealthnews.com and pharmacistben.com. You can also sign up to join the Brightside Ben team. For a one-time $25 fee, you can start yourself a longevity business, make some money selling longevity products, and help spread the word about the power and importance of a good nutritional supplement program and help change lives with nutrition and nutritional supplementation. You can sign up right off our websites, brightsideben.com, pharmacistben.com, or criticalhealthnews.com, or you can call the phone team at 866-735-2470. 866-735-2470. And if you're interested in purchasing any of our Truth Treatment Skin Health products, including our Retinol 5% Gel made with vitamin C and no preservatives, no fragrances, most folks notice results within one or two doses of the Retinol 5% Gel. Truth Serum, Truth Balm, Omega-6 Healing Cream, likewise. You can find out all about those at truthtreatments.com, truthtreatments.com. Okay, we're talking fats, EFAs, fatty acids that act like vitamins. They're basically essential, like vitamins. In fact, they used to be called vitamins, omega-3s and omega-6s. They used to be called uh, vitamin F. Some people still call them vitamin F. They were discovered in the 1920s. They didn't really know what they were, but they knew they were essential. They knew if they took them out of the diet, diseases would result. And, and in many ways, our health crises today may be at least partially, anyway, related to the fact that we're not getting EFAs in our foods. We're not getting vitamin F in our foods. E for essential means if you don't get them, you're in trouble. Skin diseases are especially likely if you are deficient in EFAs or if your EFAs are out of balance, as we've been talking. In the past, EFA balance is really important. Now, vitamin F or EFAs, are used in a structural sense to make cells, the outer coating, the very infinitesimally thin layer of oil that coats all our cells. That's, that's a pretty mind-boggling concept on its own. Cells as tiny as they are, a hundred of them can fit end to end on the head of a pin. As tiny as cells are, they're covered with a little sliver of oil that's maybe a thousand times smaller than the cell itself. And that oil is largely composed of EFA omega-6 EFA for the most part, although in the brain and in the nervous system and in the eyes, it's more omega-3 EFAs. Between EFAs, essential fatty acids, and cholesterol, yes, demonized cholesterol, you have the major components of the tiny little sliver of oil that covers all our cells, the so-called cell membrane, which is the determining factor in the health of a cell. We say all the time on this program, all diseases sell disease, but more specifically, 
all disease is cell membrane disease. And given that the membrane is made up of essential fatty acids, at least partially, it makes sense to make sure you're getting enough essential fatty acids. And that means supplementing with your ultimate EFAs and your EFA plus. Now, Certainly, vitamin F is critical when it comes to health. It's critical. Its role in cell membrane structure is critical. But the main role of these, of these essential fatty acids of vitamin F is inflammation and anti-inflammation being activated into eicosanoids, which are the active form of essential fatty acid, eicosanoids. And there's a bunch of them. Prostaglandins are probably the most famous. But if all diseases have an element of inflammation, in fact, that really is disease, inflammation being protection, inflammation being the manifestation of the immune system. If I had to cut to the chase on diseases, folks, degenerative diseases, that would be it, inflammation. There's no disease without inflammation, which is protection. How interesting is it that all our chronic degenerative diseases are the manifestations of a protective response? The real question to ask if you're dealing with a degenerative health crisis is, what is your body protecting itself from? What is the offending agent? When you have a defensive response, i.e. inflammation, logic dictates, you just ask, why is my body defending itself? What is the offending agent? That's really what medicine should be about, is getting rid of the offending agent. Not causing more damage with drugs and surgery, but figuring out why is the body in this defensive inflammatory mode. One of the major reasons the body goes into this inflammatory mode is because of a, a lack of balance between omega-3s and omega-6s, anti-inflammation and inflammation, essential fatty acids. So you have the defensive response, but you also have the nutritional deficiency response, specifically in omega-3s, although omega-6 deficiencies are probably, probably an issue as well. Part of the problem with, with understanding how significant a, a, a factor EFA deficiency is is because nobody really knows how much EFAs you need. And EFA needs vary with the day, with the month, with what you eat, with what's going on in your life. So pretty much you just want to assume, considering these things are non-toxic, you just want to assume that you're deficient in EFAs and supplement accordingly with your ultimate EFAs, your ultimate EFA+. plus. If you want to slow down the aging process, if you want anti-inflammation, think essential fatty acids. Another problem with eicosanoids, and one of the reasons why we really don't know a heck of a lot about these, certainly the medical profession doesn't really recognize eicosanoids, although, as I said yesterday, many of the drugs we use work with eicosanoids, Tylenol, aspirin, Motrin, Naproxen, pain pills in general, or eicosanoid kinds of drugs. But the real activity of eicosanoids we really don't know exactly what's going on with these things, and partially that's because they only last a fractions of a second in the body. They're ephemeral. Boom, they're there, and boom, they're not, which is a good thing because they're so powerful. One of the reasons eicosanoid-modifying drugs like aspirin and Tylenol and Motrin and methotrexate, which I use for cancer and for rheumatoid arthritis and the abortion pill, Cytotec, mesoprostol, one of the reasons these drugs are so problematic and side effect ridden and even deadly is because of how they affect eicosanoids. They make eicosanoids last longer than they're supposed to, or they make eicosanoid effects last longer than they're supposed to. In nature, eicosanoids are supposed to be on and then off. They're active and then they're gone. But when we use drugs, we throw that off. Drugs artificially extend the effects of eicosanoids, and that's one of the reasons why their so-called benign drugs like aspirin and Tylenol can have, uh, can have side effects, lots of side effects, including death. Aspirin, and aspirin is actually, aspirin overdose is actually one of the leading causes of death. I was just reading here an article on, uh, on Tylenol yesterday. Somebody posted something on Facebook that I thought was kind of interesting. Tylenol actually, they're finding out now, affects your brain, affects mood. None of this should be a surprise. Side effects to Tylenol and aspirin and to these kinds of eicosanoid-affecting drugs should not be a surprise because eicosanoids are so, so powerful and so ubiquitous, and they affect so many different systems. Here's the article here. New research surfaces uh, spelling bad news for Tylenol. It doesn't just kill pain. It actually affects your mood. Participants who took acetaminophen in a study reported feeling fewer strong emotions when they were shown pleasant or very disturbing photos. 
All right, I'm Pharmacist Ben. Our phone number, 844-236-6010. We'll take a break and come back right after this. Thank you for listening to GCN. Visit GCNlive.com today. Okay, we are back on the bright side. Got lines open for you, 844-236-6010. 844-236-6010 is our number. If you want to purchase any of the longevity products, please call the Bright Side Ben phone team at 866-735-2470. Make sure you ask about the Beyond Tangy Tangerine Liquid Nutritional Supplementation. Always best to go liquids. Bypasses any digestive issues that you have. They go right to work, and they work rapidly as well. That's why folks get such quick results from the Beyond Tangy Tangerine, usually within one or two doses. If you're interested in purchasing any of our Truth Treatment products, including our Retinol 5% Gel, you can go to, head over to truthtreatments.com. We also have a blog at truthtreatments.com, which we uh, update regularly with news stories, as well as blog posts on skin care and skin health issues. Okay, 844-236-6010 is our number. Got lines open for you. We're talking about icosinoids, icosinoids in disease, icosinoids in aging, icosinoids in cancer. Cancer is in many ways an icosinoid issue. That's why they give you aspirin. That's why they suggest you take aspirin as a uh, protection for certain cancers, including colon cancer. The anti-inflammatory effects of aspirin work with icosinoids. However, the best way to work with your icosinoids from a non-drug fashion is food. In fact, nothing highlights the relationship between health and diet more clearly than the link between anti-inflammation, inflammation, and what we eat. And this is all about icosinoids. It's all about vitamin F. It's all about omega fats. If you want to modify your icosinoids, eat icosinoids. At least eat the precursors, which are the omega fats. Now, it's true there's pre- there are cofactors that are involved in how the body uses these things how the body converts your omega-3s and omega-6s into active forms, icosinoid forms, the B vitamins in particular, uh, vitamin B3, niacin, and vitamin B6, pyrodoxine. Those are stupendously important in how the body makes icosinoids or activates essential fatty acids. Zinc and magnesium are two very important, probably the two most important minerals. In fact, probably The B vitamins and vitamin C, vitamin C is also important for helping make inflammatory and anti-inflammatory icosinoids. I think it was yesterday I was speaking to, we spoke to a gentleman who wanted to know about nutritional strategies for anti-inflammation, ways that you could take care of inflammatory pain with nutrition. And this is one of the reasons why vitamin C is so important. Again, very common nutritional deficiency. All nutrition, all nutrients are deficient in the standard American diet in the SAD. But vitamin C in particular and the B complex, because they're water soluble, we lose them and you can't make healthy active or you can't activate essential fatty acids. You can't make healthy icosinoids without these things. So get on your BTT, get on your Beyond Tangy Tangerine. There's really no reason when you have a supplement like the Beyond Tangy Tangerine that's packed, loaded with the B complex and vitamin C for anybody to suffer from deficiencies and take your EFAs with your BTT, take them together. They work together. The whole Healthy Start Pack works together. Get on the Healthy Start Pack. If you just want something simple, get on the Healthy Start Pack. That's the beauty of the Longevity products is they're simple. They're easy. If you want to put together your own nutritional supplement program via the Internet or via health food stores, that's great. But it's so simple and it's so easy to do it when you use the Longevity products. That's, that's what Dr. Wallach's gift and Longevity's gift is. It makes supplementation easy. It makes making money easy also. It's all systems. You have the, the Healthy Star Pack, the Bone and Joint Pack, the, the Brain Pack, the blood, blood Sugar Pack, etc. These are simple, easy to incorporate into your lifestyle nutritional supplement programs. And when it comes to making money, likewise, the systems are in place for making money. That's what Longevity is really about, systems. Making it easy for folks who don't, wanna, who don't have the wherewithal or don't have the time or don't have the interest in putting together their own program or putting together their own business, Longevity makes it easy. It's not so much that... Uh, you know, you can't get the products anywhere else, with, the, with some exceptions, of course. It's just that the systems are so easy to incorporate. Anyway, EFA deficiencies are common. Icosinoid deficiencies are common. Given their link to aging, given their link to disease, it makes sense to get yourself on your EFAs, EFA Plus, uh, uh, in addition to the entire Healthy Start Pack. Now, if you want to do it through diet, which is a good idea, there are sources of omega-3s and omega-6s. They're just hard to find. Omega-3s are found in seeds. 
They're found, uh, flaxseed is probably the best, hemp seed also, chia seeds uh, are a good source of omega-3s. And then yesterday we talked about the green leafy vegetables, algae. These are good sources of omega-3s. Don't cook, though. If The more you heat your foods, I didn't say don't cook, slightly steam maybe. The more you heat your foods, the more you're going to lose your EFAs. They're very unstable, as all fats are very unstable.